Here's another thing people don't understand. People's, people's energy enters your body. For example, let's just say that someone is being um, beaten, like a little kid, father's upset, starts beating the kid. Okay, so that father's energy is really big, he's angry, he's out of his body, and when he's out of his body, he's pushing his energy into that child. Okay? What happens is that child can be traumatized their entire life and they can carry it over into their lifetimes because they haven't released the energy that is not theirs. They're still having memory. They're still it's as though it's still happening. I just saw somebody like not even a week ago and she's like in her 60s and her dad had violated her, she's still weepy over it, she's still crying over it, okay? So I gave her five minutes and it's over. What did I do? I took his energy out of her body. I retrieved her back out of him, took his energy out of her, cleared the trauma, and it's like it's over. You know, it's really unfortunate that our world has to suffer throughout their entire lives with the pain that they lived as a child, or even as, it doesn't matter when, whenever you've had any kind of pain, whenever you've had anything that happens to you, and you have to live with it for the rest of your life. The thing is, what people don't know, is you don't have to live with it. I'm telling you straight up, clearings, cle this is why they're called clearings. We clear the energy out of your body, and it's as though it never happened, because it's just energy. Even your emotional energy is just energy. That's all it is. And energy can be moved. We can shift it. We can release it. We can clear it out. 